Ask I had you working on? Nope, I ain't got a clue what you're on about, Deadwood. Seems like if we stand around here long enough, you know, if I could have had another couple of people, we could just, you know, kill these uh, blood plague infected zombies as they come up and we pick up quite a few extra blood plague samples. We've got 14, we're going to use um, six of them between the two of us if we get back in time. Uh, before I make a decision on my. Oh, well. I was getting tired of sneaking around. Before I make a decision. Yeah, I don't think so. Incoming horror. I can't keep going. You got it sorted. She's not a slouch. I mean, this is uh, Tanya, who's been with me for a while now, and she's got all her stuff up, you know. So um, he's got everything. Hmm? After you. She's got everything but the cardio, really, and the shooting. So I suppose I could I play with her for a little bit. Although she's got the wrong gun. Well, we'll just see if we can uh, pop off some shots. <laughs> uh, she has no fuel. What's uh, up? Okay, you lead the way. He has no fuel. We have no fuel. <clears throat> we have one fuel in there. <coughs> Mid light of run. We're just gonna nip next door. This is the night time. Day fourteen night time. Um Drucker County. Fuji's. And this is Andreas. Oh no. This weight's going to slow me down. I'm on my last map here. Get him. went totally wrong then. I mean, I could have done that better, but that's the sort of stupid shit that gets you killed. Isn't it? Shoot. Lead on. I feel like death warmed over. I've got to get some help. Yeah. I'll make sure one death is all you have to worry about. No, no. No, you better not. Okay. Oh my god, no, no! Like 
Oh, fuck's sake! God. Now where am I gonna put that? You stupid cow. That's just ended the fucking game, basically. Just fucking get ripped to bits. Let's see how I can recover this now. Can't do nothing about that bitch now. It should say that is another fault with the game. I've had that, that's happened before that. I'm just trying to change character and all of a sudden she just says you won't be a problem anymore, you're dead. Because I expect to find my two down being a uh, my two down to be a, a fucking change character instead it says no fuck you you're you're uh, we're gonna kill you right you just killed my best literally my best guy and my leader in the camp guess what's gonna happen to her The got. outpost is prepped. Yes. Oh yeah. So now all's changing now, basically. All has got to change now. That is a bit of a dumbass move, I know. Right, we'll put all this stuff that we don't need in the locker. And that's what happens, sometimes you just do stupid, stupid, stupid things. sort of like solved the problem of having too many people in camp didn't it
Um. Rain. One, two. We'll we'll get some bullets later and some fuel. Just in order to get I did that. Let's get this home. No room for that. Serve you right. Oh, stupid old. Be so careful. I mean, why they don't put that on? Are you sure you really want to kill this, execute this character? You know what I mean? Instead of just saying, right, yeah, that's it, you're done. Uh, sorry for my colourful language as well, actually, but don't forget that um, it is an adult show. So you'd expect me to curse and swear. Most people do it all the time, and I don't do it all the time, but that was really damn stupid of me. And I blame the game for that because I was quickly trying to switch. It's like you come to switch your character, you spam the buttons, don't you, to get to where you want to be from where you were. I don't even know if I can be bothered with that game anymore, to be honest with you now. Right. I just get all this stuff in the right place that I want it. And that is going to be my pills. Coffee and my sandwiches. So bloody stupid. This is a load and a half. Yeah, well, you wouldn't have been having to carry it if you didn't have to. Uh, you had to shot the other guy. So, let's talk about stupid moments in uh, stupid deaths. Stupid deaths, so it's next time it's not you. Guess what? I'm going to let her die, I think, for that. It's not our fault, I suppose it's my fault, isn't it? Right, so we've got in here... Alright everybody, let's get our shit together! Zombie attack is imminent! All we needed was... 
was a helping hand. Instead, we'll just be moving on. Hmm. Fuel. Let's make sure our swords are okay. See, there's a lot of things in the game that's really stupid, like why they don't double confirm when you want to kill somebody, because that happens just by accident, like that. Um, stupid deaths, stupid deaths. Um, let me see. I was looking for fuel, let me just find the fuel first. That's it, found. Now we're going to go back, we're going to... 16-9, World War 1 bayonet. And where's it gone? Usually it goes to the bottom, but not always. It has. Repair that. This is another stupid thing, is how can you possibly repair this sword here at your outpost when you haven't got the workshop here. The workshop's 100 miles away. It's totally ridiculous. Load that gun. Now I've got to find a replacement for Nesta now. Because um, we've got no leader I'm now. I'm honestly surprised more of us aren't hurt. Construction. Not a good look for me. She should have been the one to die. In fact, I might just take her off and kill her. Execute her. Agriculture. Craftsmanship. Engineering. Construction. Um, um, Tanya, right. And what is Tanya's trait? She's a trader. We have to fight scarcity by producing valuable goods and trading them for some necessities. I don't fancy trading from the warlord thing just yet though. I wanted to complete the warlord. And now I can't do it because I've killed the bloody thing, poor guy. Um, bullets for this 50 cal. Doesn't look like there are any. Nope. So she might as well not bother carrying it. Oh, it's got five bullets in it, but that's not the point. She hasn't got much stamina strength to use that gun like the, the main guy had. Um, have I emptied the back? Yep. Uh, let's put in there. Keep forgetting this. So that was truly a night of disaster. This is the one with all the the crap in the back, I hope. We've got to thin out the infestations around here. We don't, sir. 
You can just drive this damn truck back home now. You've done enough damage for one night. You silly bitch. Them guys are no longer there anyway. Right, we're going to go and have a look at the driving. I mean, granted, she's jumped on the back of them. I'm in a bit of a jam here. Anyone out there available to help? What have I left on his body? Oh, his handbag. That's why his things are still there. My back is killing me over here. Don't care, lass. Uh, cut a little bit from the, a little bit off the top, mate. There you are. How many fuels have we got? Just the one. So we do need another, another fuel. And we could do with some more pills before we leave. When you need a pill. You don't need the pills. Oh, I can put that. Right now. Yeah, we could switch over the gear because it's got a broken door, but I'm not going to worry about that. Got all the stuff in the back of this van. Go and help this guy first. Our only saving grace is maybe this guy wants to join us and that he's going to be um, an army guy. The game right just here. might know that it wants to provide us with, or it has to provide us with a, a replacement team member. Now we've killed a guy. Abandoned my own place, airfield storage in a hurry, left the World War II Commanders 1911. I'll give you something if you get awesome. it back. After you. This is mm. a load and a half. Probably won't be able to carry it. Hmm. My bad, I did that. Oh, hey. Chemistry. Trick. I better take a break. I need it.
like the crazy setup. The whole barricades everywhere, and then there's just open areas like this. Right, okay. Best leave um, only one of those left. Why is this nipping next door? Could have gone out through that door. Glad I saw that screamer before it saw me. Trust me, we'll find what we're looking for in here. I won't just pick it up though, will I? Because I ain't got enough. Yeah, I was just thinking how much I needed that. I knew we'd find it. Fantastic. Is it me or are we dangerously low on ammo? I thought he got that. I got nothing left. Now, where am I going to put that? We don't know. We're not going to get that gun just yet until we've got. Most of our stuff back. <coughs> no room for that. Be extra careful. We've got a plague zombie nearby. Let's go backwards and forwards with this game. Um. <coughs> <coughs> I'll put one of the few ones. In the vehicle already. Plenty of um This is a load and a half. These sort of things back there. Let's just uh drop that and that. Come with me. You can at least watch my back while we're running near him. Are you joking? There was, um, those. Medipack, not medipacks, there was bottles of wine or whiskey or something in there, weren't they? I'm sure I didn't take them. I 
Okay, fair enough. That's why I cleared all the space. My back is killing me over here. There they are. Just leave it there. Now we're definitely going. Just have a look. seconds. Right. Red Talon doesn't impress me. Well organized thugs are still thugs. Just before we get on in this base, I just want to go and have a look around. I'm just getting to the highest place where I'm going to be safe. While I say thank you very much for watching, I'm going to end this video here because this is like must be day 15. Um, after a disastrous night of the 14th where I lost my main leader due to this silly woman here popping him in the head well, my fault actually but also the game developer's fault for not putting are you sure you want to kill this guy? you know, and I just went through the, the normal slam dunk buttons to change character and stand there you go you know whatever it is uh, Y down X and uh, Y down A and then you, you've you you've changed characters. Instead she says well I'm so, sorry about this I'm going to have to shoot you and she popped him in the head without giving you any option second chance. You know, are you sure you've have you made the right mistake made the right thing here have you just made a mistake of pressing buttons wrong? Bad bad move on by part of the developers. You know, the game's touch and go for me in most places. I like it generally. It is an improvement on State of Decay. This is State of Decay 2. But it's not an improvement in the sense of, oh, multiplayer. Everybody was shouting for multiplayer. They got multiplayer, but they never really got any improvements. Because they've taken things off you like boarding up windows, which they could have improved on. Um, they haven't allowed you to lock the doors, which they could have improved on. They haven't allowed you to sleep anywhere or have as many people in the camp as you want. You know, you could just, you don't have to be able to change that character, you just might be, him down there, he might be somebody on my, uh, in my party that I can, you know, that I can uh, thing it to. Anyway, uh, that I have to look after and feed. And the more people I have, the more points I gain, but also the more work it costs me, etc. Anyway, 
I will thank you for watching. I will catch you in the next video, which will be straight after this one for me, but it may be tomorrow for thee. Um, like I said, disastrous night. Now I've got to find somebody who's a warlord um, because of all the things I've already done, like making bases that are warlordish bases. And I'll come back in the next video and I'll have to just sort of like explain a lot of that again sound. because the people in the just, just seen the next video for the first time won't know what I'm going on about. Anyway, so thank you very much. I hope you watch the next video. Um, like I say, stupid deaths and all that. Uh, thank you very much for watching. Please f read the description, uh, like, follow, support, you know, the, the video any which way you can on the, the uh, channel that it's on. Thank you very much for your time. This is Andreas. Uh, peace out, I would say. Well, she would go. We might kill her. Come back and find out.